show you <clears throat> what it is that we're breathing. So obviously this cloth filter bag has trapped a lot of this dust and fine particles, but it's just caked on there and it's just really disgusting and a little bit frightening to think that you could actually be Well, thank you so much for taking the time to watch this dust collection update. I just wanted to take a moment to thank Dick and his team over at Wynn Environmental for sponsoring this video and providing the canister filter that I installed in my system today. If you're not familiar with Wynn Environmental, I'll leave a link in the description below to their website. They have a number of different uh, dust collection filtration systems uh, that will suit your needs. This particular unit that I installed today is part of their 35 Alpha series of woodworking canister style filters. They work for a number of different makes and models of dust collection systems. The system that I have in my shop is the Harbor Freight 2 horsepower dust collector. And it comes with the cloth bag. And as you can see from the video, there was quite a bit of caked up material inside that cloth bag. And from what everything that I've read about these particular canister filters, they do a much better job of filtering out all of the fine particles that float around in your shop that escape from those cloth bags. They're 99.99% efficient at filtering out down to the 0.5 micron level. And that just makes me feel better knowing that I'm going to be able to breathe a little bit better in my shop 
because a lot of those particles that are floating around will hopefully be captured by that filter. And so these filters are very simple to install. They come with everything that you need and as you can see from the video it didn't take very long. I think it took me about 30 minutes and much of that time was just moving the camera around to get different angles to make sure that you could see what I was doing. But simply put, you take the bag off of the top and you simply install that canister filter inside that ring. Now inside mine there's a conical structure of metal and so it rests on that conical structure. And then there's a rubber gasket below the bottom of the filter. Then you take the clamps that are provided along with the filter and you secure them to the lip of the inside of the filter and to the edge of that uh, conical uh, ring structure. And I just went ahead and used all six that were provided, secured that down, made sure that it was pulling that filter all the way down and uh, compressing that gasket so I have good contact with no air leaks. They also provide a couple of replacement plastic bags uh, for your dust collector. So again, if you're not familiar, go check out their website. Uh, these are some really good quality filters. And thank you so much, Dick, for providing this filter and sponsoring this video and supporting the online woodworking community. If you're not familiar with my channel, I also have uh, a video where I installed my dust collection system. I'll leave a link in the description below where you can click here to watch that video. If you like this update, please push that thumbs up and why not go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I'll have more shop updates and shop projects and uh, build videos coming out later this year. Thanks for watching.